From a human rights perspective, we continue to document serious human rights violations and human rights abuses. Our primary purpose is to monitor, document, and report on the human rights situation, especially as it relates to the conflict. And most of the data that we collect primarily is to help the mission to take decisions. So it's sort of an early warning data that um, prompt the mission to react or to respond early. We notice a slow pace in the implementation of the peace agreement. And I think this is also of concern. That has to really uh, be looked at, especially in 2023. This is a year of make or break. We are coming to the last phase of the transition because um, quite a lot of legislations are still not yet um, adopted by parliament. And it is not just legislations, it is also putting in place the institutions that will be created based on the legislations. 